doing our drawing tonight, our Friday night drawing. Let's see who gets to be the lucky winner tonight. Got about 98 names in here. Hey, Dawn. 98 names. Big jar of names. Guys, when you hop on, say hi. So I know you're here. We have a drawing at eight o'clock for the $75 gift certificate for custom art of your choice. So I hope you're on for that. And I hope you're in the drawing. If you're not in this week's drawing, you can be in next week's drawing. Very simply by pressing the community button at the top of my page and um, inviting your friends to your page. You can hit select all, send, take a screenshot that you sent it. Um, show me a picture of the screenshot. You can message it to me and I will add you to the list. You only have to do this one time. All right, once you're in, you're in. And I call a name every Friday for a prize. Okay, so I hope you partake in that. Hey, Jasmine. Jasmine was our winner last week. Jasmine gets an 11 by 14 pet portrait. <clears throat> so make sure you type hello. Hey Andrew, when you come out of there, can you let the cat out of the garage? I think he got, he got stuck in there when I was getting uh, the painting out. Thank you, buddy. <clears throat> So make sure you say hello. We'll start in about 10 minutes. All right, guys, we'll start in about 10 minutes and I'll draw the name a little after 8.05, okay? I don't know what that angry face is for. Who hit that? <laughs> Who hit that angry face? No angry faces allowed in my classes, only happy faces. <clears throat> Tonight's colors, for those of you that are on right now, we need white, Brown, if, you, if you're painting, um, you can make a lighter brown. You need like a sandy color. And then you need a blue and like an aqua blue, okay? Um, if you're coloring, whatever you can, closest to these. Uh, pink and a purple, okay? I'm throw that one in Oh, I know. Oh. Well, she knows that it's going to be a little bit late though, right, Jasmine? <laughs> you told her your gift's going to be a little bit late. I, I, I have you in my queue though. Um... And then some yellow and black, okay? I'm excited to, yours is actually probably not this week coming up, probably the next week after that, I'll probably get to yours, okay? So, not too long from now. I have to get to the first winners too. I'll do yours like right one after another. And sometimes when I do my pet portrait, Jasmine, I do a time-lapse video of me painting it that you get to keep forever. And you, it's like, you know, you can see 10 hours of work in like two minutes, which is really cool. All right, let me open this crack a window in here. It's pretty warm. <clears throat> yeah, let that cat out of the garage, please. Don't let the cat out of the garage. <clears throat> mm -mm. Oh, good, okay. Oh, so she, that's right, you did say, I think. She did tell me that she knows about it. Yeah, probably about two, two or three weeks. I'll get to that. Maybe sooner. Sometimes my queue, I get through things a lot faster. Right? <clears throat> what are the colors again? So the colors tonight, you need black and white. Always black and white for my classes. Brown. Uh, two different blues. If you have a dark and a light, if you have like a, this kind of blue, like a medium or dark blue, and like an aqua blue, even better. Okay. And then some pink and purple, pink and purple, a little bit of uh, yellow. <laughs> That's the biggest color I have here. And then, um, did I say brown? I'm sorry, I can't, brown, yeah. Hello, Becky Lane, how are you? <clears throat> but yeah, so Jasmine, it's really cool when I do, a lot of times, and I'll make sure I do it because I just told you, so how could I not do it now? <laughs> I'll do a time-lapse video for you. All right, so that way you have it. You can see the process, right? What's up, Charlie? So we are going to pull another winner tonight. 
I hope you're on. I really can't make, I can't make people come on to, you know, you don't have to be on to win. Um, because I know people have different schedules, you know, especially if they're across the country. Hey, Pat Budge. Uh, but yeah, if you are interested in being in the contest for next week, all the names that are in the star roll over every week if you don't win. So every single week you have a chance. You only have to participate one time, one time only, to be in my jar. Um, and to do that, you just go to the community button at the top of my page. It's next to where it says video, events, jobs, photos. It's in that row, all the way at the end. Um, and then invite all your friends. Hit invite, select all, and then send me a screenshot that you did it. And your name goes in this jar. And every Friday I pick a name and it's a different prize. This week it's $75 gift certificate to whatever kind of art you want to order from me. Uh, you could use it towards a, a Zoom paint party. You can use it towards a private lesson. You can use it towards a custom pet portrait, whatever you want. So you have the option, okay? <clears throat> it's not quite I know you're all the way in Australia Pat Budge so you're like daytime right you're like early day I feel like you guys are like you're like 12 hours difference how's the weather there in Australia Pat you guys are you guys in your winter yet right isn't it like opposite there than it is in the United States <clears throat> or close, like close to, I can't remember. Maybe that, maybe depending on where you're from in Australia. Hello, Linda Semp. Guys, check out these. So I know you saw the other ones, but check these out, ready? I got these today in the mail. <laughs> Aren't they great? Oh, winter, that's what I thought, but Pat. Should I wear these today doing the class? Guys, I'm having way too much fun with the teeth. It's a big overbite, too. I know, Tammy, it does feel a little wintry here. Pat's in Australia. She's down under. So I'm debating, should I wear these while I teach class? People might think they're real. Look how good they look. <laughs> Hi, Jackie May. Jackie May, I realized, after I made my funny name the other day, when I got my, my, uh, Hick teeth. I picked the same, I don't know if major middle name, which is pretty. I picked the same name for my person. Ready? Hey, right, I should keep these, right? This will make Chris want to marry me even more. Bertha's in bed right now. Yeah, she was very busy today. That that face painting video she did. This is like the 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 geeky neighbor kid teeth right here. Alright, so I'll have to come up with a good character for these. <laughs> since I'm a professional face painter I'm thinking of ordering this does make me talk funny I'm thinking of ordering um, some some pimples right adding some pimples to my face like a teenager yeah that's me <laughs> I'm going to teach class like these today I'm Tracy's triplet sister <laughs> I could be her, her long lost cousin. It actually is. is it? <laughs> Yay, we have the same name there, you Bertha. <laughs> I realized, I was like, oh, what if she thinks I'm making fun of her because I didn't realize it and I spelled it the same way. It's so pretty though, but I loved it, Bertha May. I know, so I'm saying I'm gonna get, I'm gonna order those fake pimples because I know how to do like stage makeup and stuff. And I never really had a bad complexion, so it'll be new for me. But these braces are like, Fabulous, right? <laughs> Dude, guys, you have to have fun. I mean, what is life if you can't laugh? That's why I'm a Chris, right? I laugh all the time. That man makes me laugh 24-7. I wouldn't give it up for the world. He is the funniest person I've ever met in my life. So I need to try to even be a smidgen of funniness that he is. But I think these braces are kind of close. Look, I know, and I have what, as like an overbite, and I did have braces when I was younger. My mom calls it my million dollar smile. <laughs> I can't take myself seriously in these. Look, it gives me a giant overbite. This stuff, so it comes with this white 
They're white, little white beads. <laughs> it's hilarious. It comes with these little white beads that you pour, put hot in hot water and they turn clear. And then you press them to the back and then you stick it on your teeth and then you full, press it over to, look. These are the, <laughs> these are Bertha May's teeth. Um, he's got a lot back. So, and it's molded to my teeth and then it hardens again. When you take it out of your mouth, it hardens. Isn't that the coolest thing ever? <laughs> so, you know, in movies, this must be what they use. That or they glue fake braces on people quickly, but I don't think so. This is pretty easy because it gives me that, that way I, funny way I talk. <laughs> I'm not sure what's, Melissa, how are you? How are you, friend? Do you like them? Melissa, make sure you watch my face painting video done by Bertha May, my twin sister. <laughs> Fondo. Is that what it's called? <laughs> oh my god, I've talked so much. I've already it's already 802. Yay. Isn't this pretty? I ha I can do nail art. Yeah, I can paint anything on nails. Absolutely. This is actually that color street stuff since I can't go to the place and get the dip done. I ordered the dip. It just came in. I'm very nervous to do it. This is scary. <laughs> um, this is the, the, what's that called? Color Street. And it's artificial nails too, because I don't have nails for the life of me. And when I do grow them out, they, they break. Look how I talk with these on. This is hilarious. I definitely need to do like a teenage makeup video with these on, right? So colors, colors tonight, Katie. You need brown, sorry, brown and white, black, yellow, a regular like blue, and then like a tropical-y blue. Hey, Jared Pearson. And then a purple and a pink. All right? Yeah. Those are the colors you need. And I'm going to be doing the drawing before we start painting. So if you're in the drawing this week, yay. Good luck to you. Let me see if I can take a sip of my water this way. Mm. I could do a 90s makeup video. Do y'all ever watch that makeup artist, Jamie French? She's hilarious. I love her. She does ones like that. She did the tiny hands one. And she did a 90s makeup one, an 80s makeup one. <laughs> Wait, Melissa, make sure you go back and watch the other video. You have to. You have to. My goal is to make people laugh, and I think it works. <laughs> All right, we're going to call the name. Let's give it a couple more minutes. We'll go like two or three more minutes before I call the name. Okay, got to have the clothes to go. Yes, totally true, Jasmine. Trust me, I probably have a closet full of things. I'm a, I am was born in 1978. I'm sure I got some stuff from the 90s and early 2000s still in there. Right, isn't she hilarious, Tammy? That, Melissa, if you want to laugh, you will watch Bertha. Has anybody else watched it? I have a YouTube channel now. Go subscribe. <laughs> but it's also on my Facebook page. All right. I'm going to, oh, sorry, one of these dropped out. Okay, I'm going to, one of those giant bingo things. So good luck to everybody. <laughs> I'm going to pull a name. So this week's winner and if you're interested in being in next week's drawing, let me know. All right. Hello, Patrick Toto. <laughs> next week's drawing. This is this week's drawing, obviously. If you want to be in next week's drawing, let me know. And I'll... Who's at my house right now? Who's pulling in my driveway? Hold on. Somebody's at my house.
my besties just stopped by, Miss Trenna Stout, and she dropped a, for Mother's Day. How cute is this little rose bush? And some herbs because, what'd she give me here? Oh, cilantro, my favorite. Look at that. Isn't that so sweet? Wait, hold on. Oh, I love her and I miss her. Wait, what did I miss? And when I miss all this talk right now, I gotta, I gotta scroll back. Yes, please subscribe, Jasmine. I just start. Chris just started my YouTube channel. Okay, let's see. For this painting, I was supposed to be an anti. Oh, Becky, I'm so sorry that you're not an Antigua. Well, I hope I'm making you laugh and you have fun doing this painting. Oh, oh, oh my goodness, that's such a bummer, Becky. Oh. Yes, I hope you get to go. All right. All right, let's draw the name. Me too. Cilantro is like my favorite. Some people love it and some people hate it. I find that if you like, it's like the people that hate it think it tastes like soap. All right, we ready? Okay. All right. Good luck to all. Good luck to all. I'm going to turn my head. Yo, if my neighbor sees me through the window, he's going to think I'm kooky. Isn't coriander the same as cilantro? Okay, I have a name. I picked the name. Let's see who it is. Megan McGillick. Who are I don't know. It's Megan on. I didn't see her. Come on. Congratulations to Megan McGillick. I'll have to message her and let her know that she wins $75. It's genetic. What my, oh, it's the same type. I thought so, Pat. Because I know that the leaves, I mean, the um, the dried one always says coriander. All right, guys, we are ready to paint. Congratulations to Megan McGillick. She wins a $75 gift certificate to art. Any art she wants. Okay. Should I keep the teeth in while I teach? Give me some hearts if you think so. If I see no hearts, I'm taking them out. <laughs> hey, Lori Dowdy. I know that we're on a little bit of a delay from when I ask a question to when you guys reply. It is hard. It is hard to drink. Okay, I saw some hearts, so I'm keeping these suckers in. All right. Ooh, all this time I've been chatting. I should have put the paint on my plate. Okay. Let me do that really quick while I chat some more. <laughs> Why do people put angry faces? Who is putting an angry face for a fun party? Who's doing that? Why is, what is that? Are you mad because you didn't win? Are you a spoiled sport? <laughs> Who's doing that? I never understand why people put mad faces. Goodness gracious. Let's be happy. Okay. I'm keeping it, I'm keeping it on. Keep it on. I think secretly Chris likes my braces. All right. I'm just putting my paint out. So again, black, white, brown, a tropical blue if you have it, and then like a regular blue, purple, pink. Look at all that blue. Thank you guys. Made up for those angry faces that somebody gave me. <laughs> all right. Okay. Do you have my colors? Black. I don't know if I'm going to need black right now. I don't need the yellow quite yet, so I'm not putting on. Okay. Because I'm working on a larger piece here okay i'm actually very funny chris chris is just mad i haven't done his wood burning on his uh pizza pizza thing yet i'm sorry honey i will i promise you okay i promise i will do it oh see he did he won like a whole like personality tree tammy all right we are going to start with the upper third of our painting which is our darker blue sky. So, I have a very big brush. If you're painting, use the biggest brush you have for this part. If you're not painting, you could just color it however, you know. I'm taking that deeper blue of the two and a little bit of white on my brush at the same time. All right? Look at how it replies in my name now, Chris. That's so weird. Okay. I am going to divide my canvas up. So about a third of the way down, I am going to swipe back and forth and I'm covering the whole top here. But it's not that clump that's sitting in there. 
going about a third of the way down, okay? So you can start, you can give yourself a line so you know where to stop. If you get a little overzealous when you paint. <laughs> this way you don't go past it. So right now we start off with like a medium blue, right? Sky. You're painting you do not have to rinse your brush off okay you do not have to rinse your brush off you can kind of keep it with that darker blue because then for the next all the way down to about we're gonna leave like a small ace of the so if you look here okay you want to leave a little small area I'm gonna show you we're gonna actually map it out first all right <clears throat> I'm just getting my more aqua blue and white on my brush now Okay, so it's lighter, see that? Trenna, that was so sweet of you to drop off that gift. I love you. All right, I'm just gonna go ahead and do, give myself a line down here now, but it's a curvy line because it's where the shore meets the water, okay? So this down here, from here down, you're not touching. Now you're filling all of this in with your lighter tropically blue and white mixed together, okay? So it's like your aqua bluish color and white. Do the whole, going all the way down to this curved line. Where'd my cup of water go? Next time I want to chat in the driveway, when you stop by. All right. Get all this in here. I need to put more paint on the plate. More white. There we go. <clears throat> so again, if you're coloring, might take it a little longer to fill in this area, but that's all right. Look, I got lazy up here. Uh -huh. Rinse my brush. So we have our sky, and we're not doing down here yet. Okay, we're gonna let this dry a little bit. We're gonna go down here, and we're gonna do some. I mean, we're gonna go up here into our sky and do some cloud work. So I have like a medium-sized brush, whatever you may have. All right. So when I do my clouds. Okay, I get white, the white paint, I'm dipping in my white paint. A little tiny bit of that Caribbean blue, just a little. So all these colors are the same time on your uh, paintbrush, okay? And then a tad of purple. You see that in there? Got all, all the colors, okay? And I'm gonna just tap off any extra on my, I don't want it drippy, all right? And now we're gonna sit and do Little swirls. Okay, can you let the dog down with me? Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm kind of doing little swirls. I'm freaking my kid out here with my braces. <laughs> <laughs> okay, of the clouds. All right. There, 
hair on this side coming out this side and then I'm gonna put some coming up here same thing you can even add a touch of pink right touch a pink into that but real I'm barely pressing on my canvas here I'm actually not using canvas I'm using like the back of a piece of uh, art pad paper smaller ones on the horizon and then once I get my the first part of the clouds I'm going to go back in with some more of the brighter colors okay, so now I have more pink on my brush I'm <laughs> give it some pouncing now on the edges of the clouds all right <clears throat> hey let's not break the vacuum Andrew all right Pouncing. It's like almost like a dry brush effect. I don't have a lot of paint on my brush. So if you're coloring, you want to kind of do like a little scribble effect. in with more some white see it's almost like sunset clouds right where they pick up the colors so we go back in with some more white. Those clouds so the different layers of color give it that dimension <clears throat> yeah you're not erasing I like it I don't like it <clears throat> all right all right rinse that brush out now this has, I'm gonna move this just while I do this part I'll put it back up in a little bit so I have this Hold on, sorry, I'm just lowering my, there we go. All right, so I'm gonna do my sand now. So I have my brown. It's, it's very good, Tammy, I can't wait to see. I saw all the ones you posted on my page. It's like, I gotta take these suckers out. All right, now I can talk better. <laughs> um, the ones you post on my page, I guess, it, I get the notification, but they all now go into this tab I have to hit to look at them that says, um, what does it say? I can't remember what it says, but I have to go into that to see them. No wonder I was having trouble seeing them before. Um, so for my brown, to make it more sandy looking, I'm adding a touch of yellow to it. That's why I said have yellow on hand, but you may not need it. Um, with my brown, I just want to add a little bit when I'm making it. And then, so that whole bottom part there, you're going to, hold on here, let me just mix this up and then I'll speak. Sometimes I can't do more than one thing. You're, I know, I love them all. Your penguins today were really good. Okay, so this whole part down here, you're gonna paint for the sand, right? Oh, that's a little bit too, not dark, quite dark now. Okay, so fill all this in for your sand. <clears throat> and those of you, if you wanna order paints and do my classes with painting instead of like crayons or whatever you might have at home now, uh, Michael's, I'll still, I still tell everybody about them because it's always 20% off right now. And they deliver. So you don't have to leave your house. They do a store pickup too, curbside pickup also. Um, those of you who live near me in Jersey, they just moved the Michaels in Morristown into the mall. It's huge now. 
course, we haven't gone in to see it because we're not allowed to, but it's on, like, you can see which part. It's where the old, was it J.C. Penney's is or Sears? No, no. Yeah, maybe this is. So it must be huge. <clears throat> but you can do curbside pickup there. Yeah, so when, so I don't know if I have to look at them before they get actually on the page. What is the best way to share our results? Jasmine, you can do, you can either post it under this video. When I do the video, you can send it to me in a message. Sometimes if you send it to me a message, I don't always get it right away. Um, but if you post it on this link, then everybody can look at it too. If I don't get around to uh, sharing it right away. Look at my page, it's curly. Sorry about that. <laughs> All right. Bring this a little bit closer. Oop. Okay. <clears throat> All right, so we have our sky, the clouds, the ocean, the sand, right? All of those lovely parts. So now, I still have like kind of like my medium brush. I'm gonna go in with a little, just a touch of my white and a little bit of that Caribbean type blue. So now, when I do this, it's kind of like a, I don't want a lot of paint at all, so I'm tapping any excess off. Oh, sorry guys, it glitched out on me. Um, if you can see that there, see like the bristles are real separated because there's not a lot of paint on the brush, okay? And it's white and a touch of that aqua. So I'm gonna go in and I'm gonna kind of do like waves and not waves so much, but like where the white caps out and like and there's little waves out in the middle of the ocean, right? Hey, Andrew. Oh, he let the dog in. She's not gonna hear me, I don't think. I'm at the wrong let the dog in. Right, so randomly, okay, these are random. <clears throat> okay, Corey, hold on. Right, so, and then <clears throat> along with these out here, I do the same thing at the shoreline as the wave is crashing, right, up on the shore. At the shoreline, tapping this. Thanks, buddy. <clears throat> All along the shoreline. This is where it's hitting the shore. All right. Hello, Cori. Girlfriend, what's up? Were you rolling around in the dirt out there? It looks like it. In the wet dirt, because it's rainy. Yeah, yeah. All right, so see, I'm pouncing it. Pouncing it to get that foam, right? When it hits the shoreline, it gives you that foam. Okay. Move that over a little bit. <clears throat> okay, so as it's crashing on the shore, it gives you that foam. Oh, you know what else, guys? I'm sorry, if you're not painting, if you're not painting, you need green, I'm sorry. I'm painting, so I'm mixing my yellow and darker blue together. But if you're not painting and you're coloring or using markers, you, you want to have a, a dark, darker or medium green. I'm making my own green with blue and yellow. So those who are painting, just mix your darker blue and yellow together. And so you get like a medium green. You can add a little bit of white in there too. <sighs> not too much white though, because we don't want it pastel-y, right? We don't want it like a pastel color. But we do want to, here, I'm gonna show you kind of the green you're looking for. I'm gonna show you in a second. All right. <clears throat> okay, so kind of there. A little bit darker is fine too. All right, so now we're gonna do our palm trees coming in from the sides, okay? So what I'm gonna do, is I'm gonna come out here and I'm gonna start with my two lines. So watch me first, coming out and then in and then pick up my brush, okay? And then I'm gonna do the same thing here. So these are my two branches, the main branches, right? And then I'll do one on this side. Okay, so I have three. So I have one, two, and then three. <clears throat> and they're kind of, they're scattered, right? They're scattered. So now coming out from those, 
we're gonna do all the individual palm tree leaves. Let me get it up here so you guys can see, sorry. Okay, and there's a lot. I'm just gonna keep, all right? So you're just, you're starting from the middle and then pulling out and then releasing your brush if you're painting as you get to the end so you get that pointed tip on there, right? And the side too. All the way down. So you want them like hanging, right? And if you want to do more than the three, you, you can do more than the three. <clears throat> That's up to you. You don't have to just do three. Definitely you can do more. Thanks, Jasmine. Okay, you want to pull away at the end because you don't want to have that blunt edge because palm trees have that really pointy leaf on them, right? So you're just you're pulling up at the end. And that'll give you that, that look that you're going for. Okay, and then same thing on this side here. So guys, I was gonna do a one o'clock class tomorrow, but it's Mother's Day weekend. I kinda wanna have the weekend off. So I hope no kids get upset. So I'll be back again on Monday. I just really need to decompress and... I say I'm not gonna do anything, but I have orders to fill, so of course I, I never cannot do anything. I cannot sit, I can't just sit there. I feel so unproductive. I always have to be doing something. Even if I don't have any orders, I need to be making something to try to sell. I just, I can't be lazy. Don't have it in me. <clears throat> I have to always be working. My mind is like a constant, like on 110%. But there's no, that's not a bad thing, right? I'm a hustler. <laughs> Do the hustle. We call it do the Tracy. <laughs> but yeah, I cannot just sit still. So I think the kids will be okay. Plus, my weekend classes are pretty slow because I think people are doing, I know everybody's home with each other all the time anyway, so this is kind of silly to say, but I really do think because the parents aren't working on the weekends, um, you know, they're doing things outside and, and whatnot. So my weekend classes aren't really ever that busy. I'm almost perfect and lazy. <laughs> uh, I'm almost perfect at being disorganized, Tammy, if it makes you feel any better. I am not, just ask Chris. I am like the most, I, for, but here's the thing is like for me, it, like my studio area is messy as can be, but I know where things are. It's, it's very weird. But if I were to try to like, you know, if somebody walked in there, they'd be like, what's wrong with this girl? But I know where stuff is. To me, it's organized. It's organized chaos. That's what it is. Organized chaos. Okay. So again, if you want to add more branches, you certainly can. I just like seeing the ocean and everything through there. Right? Oh, bye, Pat. So, Pat, you can always come back at any time and watch the videos in my videos tab. There's tons of recorded ones. I hope you're doing well, Pat. Tell Whitney hello. All right, so now I'm gonna go down to my sand area and I'm just gonna add little things like starfish and shells. <clears throat> Let me give myself a little bit more yellow because I'm gonna make my starfish like an orangey color. So every time I do a, a starfish on paintings like this, everybody tells me they look like Patrick Starfish from SpongeBob, which is fine because he's adorable, but it, they, do. they do. It's kind of hard not to. <clears throat> all right hey Anne marie all right so you're if i'm gonna do a starfish you know it's just got the five little arms coming out right five arms and you can do i'm gonna do another one i'll do another one over here all pink this looks more like patrick <laughs> 
right? And some shells, a couple shells. I'm gonna do some shells in like a deeper brown. And hmm, let's add, do a little bit of every color together. You know those clam shells? Well, I think it's a little bit too much paint. So those clam shells, I'm gonna throw some of those on there that are all those pretty colors together. A clam shell. Megan, Megan McGillick, you won the drawing this week. I see you on. I hope you're on still and you hear me. If not, I'll message you. Oh, well, congratulations. Oh, but Jasmine, it looks so beautiful. I don't know if you hear me, Megan. I'll message you. I'll message you. Congratulations. So little clam shells everywhere. You know, whatever you want shell-wise, everybody. Whatever you want. You can add some coconuts. Well, though this, the coconut part's really kind of further back on the tray. Um, you can add in, you know, like how the, let's do that. I'm just gonna do it and if somebody wants to make it on there, they can, they don't have to. I'm just adding it on this painting. So, I'm gonna do the trunk of the, the palm tree. So it's like going off the page, right? So it's like over that way, but, so you can do that too, going into the sand. Why not? Do what you want. Right? Just if you want to. I don't know. I was just throwing that in there. Why not? Need to go, but well, yeah, definitely. Sounds good, Yvonne. Woo, look at that. Happy little trees. Happy little shells. Happy little clouds in the sky. Oh, guys, that's so crooked. <laughs> I realize this now. My easel's so old. So, my friends, that's it. That's our tropical beach scene, right? Yay! <laughs> so, again, I will be back Monday. I'm taking the weekend off for Mother's Day. I deserve it. Gosh darn it. <laughs> um, so, thank you all for joining me again. Those of you who are not in my contest yet and would like to be in next week's contest, I don't, I don't, I have to think of what I'm going to give away next week. If you want to be added to the jar of names, okay, there's almost a hundred people in here right now, um, and I pick one every week. All you have to do is go to the community tab at the top of my page, okay, the community tab at the top of my page, hit um, invite friends select all and send and take me a take a screenshot that you send it to your friends and send the message to me that way i'll add your name you do this one time and one time only and you are in the contest okay happy mother's day to all of you too and even if you're fur baby mommies happy mother's day for that also i will see you guys back on monday unless i decide to do a funny video which we never know right look ready we never know We never know if I'll be back. Bertha May might make an appearance this weekend. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye.